in my previous videos uh, uh, when I did all these uh, virtual machines over here uh, all of them I was not able to um, log into my virtual machines uh, if you remember I was not being able to log into them directly uh, through the domain accounts for example if I run oh, this one is already done so let me uh, show you the example <coughs> so <clears throat> like uh, this is my domain account you see but normally you have a like a uh, field for uh, uh, username and password like this one you enter your username you enter your password and you're joined for example if I s write in Trump and I give the password it give me this error message it says uh, you don't have the sufficient rights for the remote desktop service uh, by default if you're the member you should be able to but if you're not and you they were removed you have to go and manually uh, give the rights so when I go to my server here <coughs> and active directory and user on the computer when I click on Donald Trump and I click on properties and I see member of it is member of a uh, remote desktop right here uh, <coughs> you see right there it, it should uh, it should be able to log into this uh, machine but it's not and like on my floor there are 200 computers uh, uh, in uh, on one floor you can actually sit on any one of them and you don't have to ever have to uh, face this error there's nothing wrong everything is configured fine and the workaround I found was that uh, you log in with the local user log out and then uh, when you log in with the domain account it works and I thought maybe it's because that um, it's not connected to the Ethernet like when the computer boots up and before logging in it's not connected to the uh, Ethernet network uh, once you log in then it gets the IP address and goes you know all that good stuff unless it was already on and got the IP address once and then you were just simply just restarting it and you don't uh, like the ne computer never shuts down <coughs> properly I thought maybe it was it so uh, the fix is there that uh, basically it's uh, not very productive if you have to log in with the local user and what if you face it in the real world and you say hey, maybe it's just uh, the virtual machine that's doing it and in the real world you will not face this issue but actually you can solve it in the virtual machine as well you see I haven't logged into my local user <coughs> still I'm, I'm gonna get that error if I try now I got that error so fix is that uh, in uh, all of the virtual machines doesn't matter it's Hyper-V VMware or VirtualBox there's a um, feature called enhanced mode uh, but uh, specifically in uh, Hyper-V is this one so <clears throat> if you can see this is saying if I click on it it's gonna go back to basic session and enhance mode is basically lets you allow <coughs> you to access uh, the physical resources of the computer uh, for example uh, USB CD drive uh, of the actual host machine uh, uh, network and uh, um, let's say uh, audio everything of the uh, that that's it uh, the physical resources of the host computer you can access them but <clears throat> to take care of this problem that you have to log in either local user or you're scratching your head wow just click on the basic session and where is it <laughs> you see now it's connected Ethernet is connected and I don't know why it's uh, I think it's kind of hanged here uh, let me see if I can click it's doing something so the message is gone when I click on it <coughs> all right so there it is 
uh, it gave me the Donald Trump let's see oh it's still working give it the password and you see I'm able to log in so basically that was happening is that if you are in enhanced mode it will not allow you to log in with the domain accounts uh, for some reason you have to log in and then log back out with a local user and then you can uh, use the domain but uh, it's a quick fix neat fix uh, <clears throat> and that's how you can um, directly log into your virtual machine with the domain uh, joined account all right if you it if that this video helped you and you were in the same draw like uh, you were scratching your head what's happening and uh, you were looking for a fix uh, uh, please share rate comment this video and try to subscribe if you haven't already I just found this one uh, accidentally I was just going through all these uh, uh, icons and I saw that and I clicked on it and then I thought maybe that's it and it was so I decided to make a video if uh, anybody else is having these issues um, they can finally get a solution for it all right thank you and for a change this video is being made uh, like you see uh, in the morning normally I make my videos uh, at night uh, well let's finish this video and make the next one